Oh yes, I need to change the title. Thank you. There we go, we're at the top of Sherman Hill. Oh, we've got lights, look, they've automatically come on. Woohoo! Evening driver, today you're hauling a heavy coal train bound for Laramie where the next crew is waiting for and your next train home. Your power is the Katie Heritage Unit of UPs. It's a be safe and have a good trip. We have a green light. Forwards. Gently forward till we've got all the slack. Thinking dog, thanks for joining. Hope to uh, see you again. This is the Dr. Pepper livery, Moggy. This is one of my favourite liveries. The Missouri, Kansas, Texas. It's the different reds that make it look like the uh, Dr. Pepper livery to me. See you later, Gouger. A whole train cresting the uh, the grade there. Full coal, steam and jam. Now we've got enough of the train on the downhill that we're just going to. It'll speed up on its own now. 
Good night, Strat Shadow. Hey there, trucker man. I'm good, thank you. Hope you are too. Did I get the achievement in the beginning scenario? Yes, I did. Yeah. Oh, it's Western Pacific Heritage. That's another lovely livery, isn't it? Yeah, go for it, train boy. It's a nice delivery, that Western Pacific one. All the UP ones are nice. Yeah, Chicago Northwestern's another nice one as well. I can't. I, I, I almost forgot about my train, um, 1897, because I got off my train. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Blowing the horn, I need to get on. Let's get back in the cab and watch what we're doing. Uh, GWR tonight's GW GP38 scenario is a high hood. Sherman Hill sounds good, Train Boy Cole, because I've not really run much on Sherman Hill in the uh, in recent times. So it's one of the reasons I was quite happy to run this. It's um, an opportunity to uh, give it a go. the turbine. I've run it a little bit. I haven't run it much, I have to say. I, I could probably do with running it a bit more. That looks like a mighty long train reversing over there.
Uh, the camera's plugged in, the controller's plugged in, but the rail driver software is using it. So if I touch the controller, it'll operate controls. <laughs> I normally try and remember to oh, unplug the controller before I start the software, but I forgot this time, so I can't use the controller. Besides, we're going above 20 miles an hour. You go above 20 miles an hour and the controller can't keep up. It because the controller camera is 20 miles an hour. Essentially. Yeah, riding off into the sunset train boy. Fly Scotsman, thank you for the host. Much appreciated. How much longer are we going to stream? We've got another 40 minute scenario after this one finishes. I don't know exactly how much time this one's got left. Night bait being kid. That's better. Head to head. What does that look like from the side now?
Everything's doing alright. Down to 17 and a half miles to go. <laughs> Didn't forget about the horn. I did. I wouldn't submit a fail. <laughs> Forty followers in workshop. Nice BNSF. Must be the ocean crossing. Uh, possibly um, custom hitcher. Possibly. Cheers, Moggy. Thanks for joining in. Oh, I forgot the bell, did I? Welcome back James. 15 miles to go. Remember spadding on that one? Yes, I do, Zach. When is the next TBTS? Um, Thursday, I think. I think I'll do it on Thursday. It's tomorrow. No, yeah. it's Monday today. The I don't know. I might do one tomorrow. Might do one tomorrow. It's Tuesday tomorrow, isn't it? Or today. Okay. 
this quarter one in the morning. Oh, you know what time it is? Oh, it's drinking a cold cup of tea time. Lovely. Will the 24-hour stream go to YouTube? Yep, it will do. All in bits um, per scenario like it did last time. Sandman, this is um, from the Union Pacific Heritage Pack. No, I can't do it as one 24-hour vid, Zach, because um, I have enough difficulty getting a two-hour video to upload. Oh, that's really sad to hear, Dean. Really sorry to hear that. Yeah, it was almost iced tea. No, it's not finished yet. Oh, it works, Cop Plopper Mal. Um, but it, it's, it takes. Uh, you have to re-upload. Tell Twitch to re-push it half a dozen times until it gets it. So I try, try and avoid long videos now if I can. Road driver camera's frozen again, is it? Yep. Oh dear. There you go. <laughs> Rule fourteen L at high speed. Oop, we got the road driver cam working again. not the rail driver overheating, what happens is that the USB hub, it's a separate USB hub and I th something keeps making it reset itself which causes the anything plugged into it to, uh, to freeze up, <coughs> excuse me, to freeze up. It's quite nice with the rocks in the background. Slowing down a little bit. Amtrak Master, there is. It's um, exclamation mark horn space 14L. There's a 14B and a 14 something else for forwards and backwards as well, which regularly get abused. This feels like it could be a reasonable shot. 
Oh, look at the S. The S bend on the wagons there, look. See them going all the way back round that way. and you can Oh, you can see your retail power on the back, look. That's the entire train. Cool. <laughs> Cheers, Brooks Rail. Amazing Harry, where's the end of this snow? 10.9 miles. Oh, there's no other bits in it. Just stop at Larry Main. Larry Main 1 Depot, 10.8 miles. What I've been up to lately, Dean? Um, get myself into the usual trouble at work. <laughs> uh, just really mostly busy at work. On the uh, bank holiday weekend playing model trains. I think the estimate of uh, 30 minutes might have been a bit under for this though. Twenty minutes just to make that See that ram track? I think I am going to call it at the end of this scenario. Um, it's getting a bit late now. I will move uh, East Fredericktown to tomorrow. <coughs> Make sure it gets done tomorrow. Three and a half hours, so it'll be not far off four by the time we get there. Do I find German scenario difficult? Um, not quite sure. Some of them, yes, not all of them. The PZB is what makes it more challenging. Uh, amazing Harry, this is the same stream that started at 9 30. <laughs> I thought that was a crossing. Yeah, it says 55 minutes on Steam, yeah. Can't remember what it says in the game. I go by what people put in the spreadsheet. And in this case, allowing te 10 extra minutes wouldn't necessarily help. Because, of course, I had to restart a uh, gouger scenario. 
Uh, no, there's no Australian DLC on, uh, offered. That's fine, train boy. Not a problem. Enjoying the scenario. That's what matters. Yeah, it's a great scenario, Stephen Jam. Yes, I remember you, Amazing Harry. Six point nine miles to go. Uh, couple of them out. Um, yeah, put scenarios for the 24 hour stream in the regular spreadsheet in the notes field, say for the 24 hour stream, and then Francois will copy it over to the um, the appropriate place. He's got a special tab collecting all 24 hour stream submissions together. Gently going downhill, we seem to be. Our friction seems to be maintaining us. Amazing Harry, 24 hour stream is this weekend, Saturday and Sunday, 9th and 10th of April. Very gently slowing down, but only very gently.
Corel. Need the alerter, DWI. Yeah, this loco doesn't have an alerter on it. It's supposed to, but it doesn't. Four miles. Three and a half. Bit of glorious straight track. Oh, we're still coming around the corner up there. Will there be a train spotting scenario tomorrow? I will try and do a train spotting scenario. I've made a note in the list to. Uh, Put a train spotting scenario in. Yeah, this is a very long train, couple of a very long train. Cheers, uh, Dean. Take care of yourself, mate. Make sure I choose the right one, Zach. <laughs> What's the right one? <sighs> um, Dave, yes, we will be running Minecraft. Um, it's uh, Wednesday. Brain no longer working. Two point four miles to go. Let's have a quick look at the map. There, my main one depot. Yep, that's where we go in. Didn't ask that. Oh, I've no idea if we're blowing stuff up. That's that's EC's job, not mine. <laughs> Setting stuff on fire and blowing it up. That's his job. Chad, 1992. Thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. Yeah, it's 107 at the moment.
Ah, oh, nice Dave, we could see on the stream. Final destination reached. Scenario complete. Apparently we didn't have to stop there. <laughs> nice! That was a really good scenario, train, uh, train boy. Really nice, that. Did Mallard ever have a corridor tender? Yes, it only ever ran with a corridor tender. I think. <coughs> I would have liked to have stopped, but unfortunately I couldn't. I suspect it's because you've just gone from the start to the final destination. There's no stop at marker in there. Right. Um, nicely done. Okay, that's it from me tonight, folks. I've moved East Frederick Town Local to tomorrow. And uh, I'll pick some more stuff for tomorrow. Um, otherwise than that, thanks for watching. And uh, I will uh, see you tomorrow at 9.30. Alright. Bye-bye.